Welcome back everybody and today we have the mysterious world of the dinosaurs. So firstly no copyright intended, all artwork belonged to the owners and this was another thrift store find, two bucks and we've got yeah just uh, something you don't see every day, a T-Rex catching a Pteranodon pretty cool that's some nice artwork there full page beautiful nice Cretaceous ocean scene nice very nice octopus okay so this is written by John Heritage and illustrated by W Francis Phillips and other artists 1980 when I was born so this is quite an old book over 40 years old isn't that right buddy <laughs> look at that guy just grinning there the ceratosaurus and these two are having a conversation ooh uh, that Stratus, that Stratosaurus got his ass whooped. Anyway, nice. We've got the contents here. The famous Triceratops skeleton. And that looks like a, an Allosaurus uh, in the battle there. I really like the artwork. I like the like the style of the. I don't know if it was painted or like drawn. It looks painted. Nice, nice artwork. Some fossils. Got this um, early amphibian. Uh, what's its name? Diplocolus. Dip. Diplocolus. And I'll butcher that. I'd love to get a figure from that from one of the toy companies. Just awesome looking creature. Got an iguanodon. Right, we got scar. Here's my favorite ceratopsian, Staracosaurus. Proceratops. Nice, the age of fishes here. It's a nice picture. This is the Devonian period, I'm guessing. It's a nice landscape. What period is this? The carbon fury, carbon, carbon furious. So we've got a lot of the what kind of plants in the forests. Nice. It's one thing we don't get enough of the the plants. All right, we've got the Permian period. Adathosaurus. That's a very nice picture of Adathosaurus, just chilling on the rock. So that's that's Scutosaurus or something like that. Some really bizarre creatures in the um, in the Permian. It's, it would have been amazing to see if um, that extinction didn't happen at the end of the Permian period to see how life would have evolved. So we got the Triassic period going now. Morphosaurus. We've got Brachy having a swim. Some more underwater action going. 
It's a brontosaurus. Yes, yeah, here we go. It was changed. Many people call it brontosaurus, but that is not correct. Apatosaurus. When they found another species and named the brontosaurus, I think that controversy with that. But it's always brontosaurus to me. That's a nice picture there. The thunder lizard. Got one of the early Ahmed dinosaurs from the Jurassic. <laughs> Look at that Allosaurus coming to stalk that Stegosaurus. Like the artwork is not accurate at all, but I, I just, uh, I think it's a nice style. It, it, it's really nice. Got to appreciate it for what it is. And there we go. They're going in battle now and <laughs> Stegosaurus is going to take a bite. Jeez. That's a full on battle going on there. I love it. Francis Phillips. Some flying, the flying lizards. It's nice that they actually added this section into the book. Here we go. One of the most famous dinosaurs, Archaeopteryx. We've got some. Marine reptiles or sea crocodiles. Oh, iguanodon, old school iguanodon, upright, the flap under the on the neck there. Love it. Gorgosaurus. That's like the. I have to find and compare it to. The book that I read, that paleo art book that I did, because it was that Russian, I forgot the name of that famous Russian painting, and the, it's the same kind of posture with that T Rex and this one. So I need to compare the two. Actually, that wasn't T Rex, that's Gorgosaurus, and this is T Rex. I kind of got the head shape kind of correct, kind of. Francis Philip and. T-Rex battling a Styracosaurus. I'm not sure if they actually live at the same time. I think Styracosaurus was extinct by the time T-Rex was around, I think. Um, I'm not too sure. But I, it may be the fact, but that's, that's a good little battle scene going. Got Triceratops. Monoclonus. Centrosaurus, I guess. Ankylosaurus, Ankylosauri. It's a fat ass club. Got some duck bills. Some of the ostrich dinosaurs. It's T Rex stalking them. Some more flying reptiles, and again, some nice piece of artwork there with the Mesosaurus. I'm guessing unsolved mystery. This is probably um, the extinction. They weren't wrong with the volcanoes, you know. Obviously, the I think the volcanoes and the meteorite was a combination together so I mean at this time they used to think it was the volcanoes so the world's temperature dropped yeah it would have dropped probably from the volcanoes and the asteroid so I'm kind of like on the right path I guess and I oh, yeah, got a a prehistoric shark there so yeah 
yeah, nice, nice book, this one. Like, obviously, the artwork is completely inaccurate. Like, it, all, all the proportions are all wrong and so forth, but... Nice artwork, nice book. I'm happy to add this one to the collection. Let me know if you own this book or... Or you borrowed it from the library back in the day, in the comments. Anyway, I'll see you all next time.